All right, hello and welcome to Discovery Freelancer. Not sure how long this season's going to go for, but I figured might as well have a check out of one of the major mods. Crossfire was not an option, so let's go into Discovery and hope it works. Now, unfortunately, even though this is an open single player, it does start us roughly at the start. However, it gives us a good amount of money in a, sh in a, in a rank, so we should be able to get out there and hopefully make some difference. So it gets us 29 to start off, okay. Um, we don't have any reputation, so technically at this point we could do whatever we wanted. And we've got around 80k before we reach our next level. Now obviously the first thing I'm going to do is check to see if they have a new ship. Huh. Those are a lot different than I am used to. So, uh, okay. Um... <laughs> Uh, the price tag there is a little bit higher. And interesting as well, there's also... First of all, the power out output is massive. Okay, power output is massive. And they actually say power output, which is also interesting. They also say maximum turn time and time to max turn. So it's talking about how they've got the speed in the spec sheet. I like that. Speaking of, what about our ship? Um, we can get three guns as usual. Um, we've got decent armor. Very nice cargo. Um, not as good as a star crack truck, obviously, but yeah, I mean it's it's interesting, right? The power output's relatively good. What sort of items will we have in this mod? How hard will it be? <laughs> Alright, so we've got advanced flashpoints. Class 8 guns on a class 6 mount. Well, I don't want to un unhook those, do I? Because I don't want to risk it, like, not working. Last thing I want is a downgrade. Also, whoa. Look at all the different countermeasures. And they've got different ranges in effectiveness. So the Sentinel has the largest range but the lowest effectiveness. Whereas the Silencer and Fortress both have lower ranges but higher effectiveness. Interesting. Oh god, there's so many everythings. There's so many everythings. Corona Beam Cannon. Damn! Liberty Antimatter Cannon. Mount to a bomber with a special weapon. Okay, that explains it then. But damn! A fighter with a special weapon. Hard point. We can get cloaking devices? Okay. And chain gun rounds, just separate bullets. Okay, in fact, there's a lot of separate bullets here. Hellfire rocket pod, train disruptor. Oh, wow. Oh, well, at least we know this is working, and it's working out of the bloody tin, so thank you for that. Um, one thing we can definitely do is upgrade our... Oh, well, we can't because we don't have the money for it. Damn. Well, there are different... Oh, what's this? Huh. I guess they're just for looks, because they don't seem to do much. Yeah, I'm going to assume those are for looks. And we've got a bunch of shields. Um, and we've got something called a Cheetah Thruster. Which is somehow even better than the Thruster. But here's the thing. The Thruster is as good as the old Thruster. Also, Hyperspace Beacon. What the hell is a Hyperspace Beacon? Okay. Oh boy, I was not expecting this either. Okay, so we've got engine... It's been ages since I played Discovery, I'll be honest. We've got e separate engines, which increase the, I assume, the um, high speed. Um, this engine's in for fight light, light fighters, light fighters, top speed 400. They're both the same, but one is a little more expensive. And then scanners. Scan range 1500, okay, 15,000. Then range goes lower, but the cargo range goes higher. Interesting, okay. Oh wow, there's a lot. What is the Jinsku scanner? 
Developed by Kishiro, the Jinsu scanner is a technological showcase of what might be the scanner of the future. An array of nanofilaments forms a receptor, pushing its detection range out of distances previously only attained by much larger capital ships. Okay. Wow. And we got some IDs we might. We got some armor. Wait, can I just. Well, I'm base held by 2.5 take no cargo ships. Can I mount this or. Yep, it's mounted. I just got some armor. Okay, and tons of engines. Interesting, they have lower top speed with their gunboats, that's why. Interesting. Then again, 300 is the base freelancer one, and they go got to 400, so that's interesting, isn't it? Unfortunately, we can't really go straight into trading at this point because, uh. Oh, okay. Discovery RP rules. Nah, I don't care about that. I'm not on an RP server. Holidays. Holidays. Now that's cool. You can actually take people on holidays places. Serious history. Okay, let's see if we can work out here. Um. Entity and rising between Bretonia and Qatari. Wild raids begin. Okay, wait. Oh, here we go. So this is where we land up. Pop, oh, no, no, no. Passage from Omicron Theater. Eater has discovered. Corsairs gain direct count to our territory. Nomads attempt to overtake Cirrus. It's stopped by the order. Single player campaign set through 800 to 801. So this is what happened after. No man infested humans from Rhineland populate the uncharted Omega system. The wild are formed. Ooh, interesting. Um, tensions rising for Bretonia and Kasari. The Wild begins sp sporadic raids against Rhineland. It continues its present day. Okay, so they're evil. Gotcha. War between Bretonia and Kasari has started and continues to this day. Wild ships are seen as far as New Berlin. Kasari forces occupy Town 31 in decisive battles. Bretonia fleets are defeated in retreat to Leeds. The front line of in Town 31 stabilizes, but, but fighting continues. No big gates built by the wild are discovered. Rhineland gains proof that Liberty conducts secret experiments on the nomads. Um, Galea reclaims language docks and invades the town systems, forcing Kasari to end the war for Bretonia. Okay. Uh, Kasari's government, as I said to the present day, but anyway. Kasari's government is overthrown and the Emperor is exiled from the small suite from Bretonia. Liberty advances into the war with Rhineland. Numerous factions un undergo upheaval as Galea ships about to power in Cirrus. Galea breaks through Bretonia lines and claims Leeds. What? <laughs> Excuse me? The French are just attacking Leeds? Rhineland destroys jump gates leading to the Humbug system, protecting, preventing libertar libertarian attacks through those gates. Liberty, hence scaling down war with Liberty. Liberty begins to redirect military forces towards the Bretonia to help stop the Gallic advance. Kasari opens up trade with Gallia but faces internal t turmoil as she does its riot. The main return of the exiled Emperor. Oh, God. So things are going poorly, yes. Now we've got a lot of trade things here. So spring breakers? Tobacco? Vodka? Welcome to Discovery. Here we go. Thanks for downloading and discovering the Freelancer Discovery modification. The mod's purpose is to expand the Freelancer universe without spoiling its original atmosphere. We are not trained to every aspect of Freelancer that could be possibly changed and our intention to create a total conversion mod. I <laughs> you say that. In the list of Discovery features is huge and growing feature release. The number of modifications integrated in familiar Freelancer world. I mean, fair enough. It's not replacing anything. The year is 820 AD after settlement. Yes, after settlement. 19 years after the single player campaign of Freelancer and two years after these the event of Discovery 4.86. Okay, interesting. So there's a little bit of inter version changes as well. The Suez sector is still involved, embroiled in one major war, while other small conflicts are approaching critical instability in other regions. Bretonia has been forced to retreat from the GRN offslot. Also, Leeds is now under the control of Agalia. The GRN's seemingly unstoppable advance has overflowed into other systems. And even now, the scouts approach on the independent royals to connect Bretonia to Liberty. However, in response to Gallia's 
Increasing threats, Liberty is diverting some of its own naval squadrons to the region in order to slow the hostile advance and protect the key shipping lanes between the two houses. This is only becoming possible due to drastic action by Rhineland, in which they severed the jump, jump, jump case to Hamburg system in order to halt further Libertonian attacks. While these two houses are still taking the war, the scale of the conflict has been greatly reduced. However, despite facing less aggression from Liberty, the choice between focusing its attention on the front in previous years has had dire consequences behind the lines. Red Hazine movement has run rampant in Dresden system, claiming most of it for themselves. Meanwhile, a mysterious disaster in the Munich system is calling thousands of settlements to flee there. The investigation is still continuing. Having been defeated by Galia in the field of battle, the newly formed Republican government of Kasari has opened its borders for economic exchange. Their intention is to remove their not insignificant infrastructure with technologies produced by the Gallic corporations. However, all may not go to plan as there is civilian uprest driven by the exiled imperial family who would like to see them return to the throne. Soon the Kasari exile fleet will be returning home and it will not be quiet. Discovery 8.7 is focused on improving and updating much of the content added in the previous version, with greater diversity of equipment available for different ship classes, made commodities for the opportunity, um, giving exciting opportunities for profit throughout lawful and unlawful trade routes. NPCs are now fewer but more challenging to defeat. There are many more changes in addition to um, bugs enhancements introduced in Discovery. See so read me for a full text. The modification is tested to make sure each release is bug free, but you should not encounter any issues. Discovery is playable on both multiplayer and single player game modes. The original single player has been disabled, is no longer compatible with the mod, and thus open single player is enabled. Okay. Fair enough. <laughs> I'm not sure how I feel about this, to be honest. Um, well, actually, I know how I feel about this. Very intrigued. And unsure if I'm actually going to be able to do any good. I feel like I can't leave this system until I've done a few jobs here. Yeah, 500,000 credits. Dear God, how much... How much am I going to get paid for this missions? These missions are nothing. Oh, wait, wait, never mind. There are a few that are quite high. 71. I guess they're... Okay. Realistically, I should probably start with a smaller um, job. And then see how easy it is. I don't even know if this is going to work out well. Let's see, it says difficulty rate is 12. Plus kill per kill bounties. Nice. We need to do something to stop the Xenos in there. We've... He should have eliminated the only the large station. Okay, but they say per kill bounty. So obviously, individual... Oh, I don't think I actually accepted that. I didn't actually accept it. I don't know what was going on in my head right then. I'm sorry. Also, I, I, I know I'm only up here for a few seconds, but I... You yeah, see, this is what the old um, man Manhand looks like, and I'm not sure if I think it looks more or like it, because as you see, we're outside of the HD realm, so we're definitely having lower quality at the moment. I think that the default one looks more like what we see, because we're seeing the the big cloud on the top, we're seeing all the... Um, all the snow. All right, let's 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 try this again. Oh, it's changed already. Well, okay. What's the lowest level one we can do? Uh, screw it. Detroit debris field. Yeah, I'm sure that'll go well for me. It's not too far away. But yeah, I can't help but notice there's another space station there. Wait, Trenton Outpost. Wasn't there one called Trenton before? We've uploaded the mission waypoint into your nav map. Refer to mm, maybe it was there. Maybe it's gotten bigger. Which I guess makes sense. Time has passed. I was kind of noticed a small bit of lag. I hope that doesn't say. I mean, as long as it's still playable, I don't mind. But, you know. Now, the interesting thing will be, has anything changed? Okay, there we go. There's a change. They've actually got a uh, trade lane going into um, Alaska now, which is a little bit interesting. A trade lane going into Alaska? Huh. Interesting choice there by Liberty Navy. Oh, I hope I can do this mission. You're getting close. Oh, well, they're half health, so... 
You're in range. Remember, we've marked everything you need to take out. You say that, but... I mean, I'm certainly gonna try, though, so... Oh, wow, that, uh... Shields went down quick. I do not have any countermeasures, guys. Good job. They won't be rebuilding here anytime soon. Okay, so... Th that wasn't too bad. Definitely could have been easily killed there, though. Not by the ship, so that's good. Because I don't want the NPC missions to be too hard at the moment. I just want to explore. Unfortunately, it does look like we'll be here for a little bit, so... Fine. Oh, the slight lag is doing me in, but that's okay. Hopefully it's not going on the recording. Does not look like it's any worse than the recording it is, in, is for me, so... Okay. Alright, let's go back into Manhattan, but get a few more of these places on our scope. So, we're going to stay here for a little bit. We're going to explore each of these stations, so we've got a few trade route ideas out. Also, I've got to see what sort of loot I actually got from that, if anything. Um, also, also, I need a countermeasure, because those missiles were a lot more powerful than I'm used to. Okay, speaking of... We've already got some, uh, maybe just wait until I pick one up randomly then. Also, I can't help but notice, hey, look at the cruise speed. It's a lot faster than it ever was before. 425? Damn! I am very glad I got that armor, though. Just saying. So, obviously, the advanced thruster has become... Ooh, hello. Ooh, and you can just be sold. I see what it meant, plus... Plus, um, bounties. That's fantastic. If I take them to a battleship or to a tourist prison, I don't want to go to Texas, though, because honestly, Texas seems scary. <laughs> I know that's bad, but Texas seems scary to me now. I'm just going to stay around, around New York for a little bit, you know? Oh, wow. That, that's how much damage happened already? Jesus. Alright, let's go see if I can get a cruise disruptor. I can't, because I can't afford one yet. Well, that, that's nice. Also, they're selling ships here too now? And they're selling different ships? Whoa. The Sashi. 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 The Tokesu. Which is exactly the same thing, but... Wait, what? It's got more... It's just better. What it's turning arcs like? 600, um, let's see, maximum turn rate 70, 64, 1.96, 1.6. It's not that much slower, really. That's a lot better, though. I'm mean, granted, it's like seven times the cost, so fair enough. But, okay. I shouldn't be compa complaining, don't get me wrong. It's just uh, a whole new thing. A whole new world. Okay, I'm not going to sell that there then. Ooh, credit cards. Uh, not sure why you'd want that, but I guess there's roleplay reasons if you wish to give away money to someone. Okay, interesting, interesting. Let's go do another mission. Discovery is apparently all about discovery. Who knew? Um, and apparently bribes. Gateway shipping. I think they'll just like me over time anyway. It's fine. I'm going to do some missions. All right, let's go for a nice, simple destruction mission. It's a little bit more difficult than the last one, but I think that's the way to go. The destruction was not too bad. Um, and we get more of those bounties. Definitely think that's that's fun. One dash one. This is Newark Station. Good flying. Oh, that's interesting too. I see why they do that though. I definitely see why they do that. Also, this means the planet looked different. One thing I will miss is seeing the really far view distance. As you can see, we can't see the other, um, we can't see the other trade lanes anymore. We also can't see jump holes. <laughs> Things are popping into into this into view. It's kind of a shame. All we can see is planets. So I wonder if there'll be different trade lanes where we go, because if Kasari is no longer relying on... Was that a battleship over there? 
if Kasari is no longer relying on Liberty Tech, then what does that mean for their ability to expand? More importantly, what happened to all those border stations where they were building trade lanes? Are they being finished? No. Oh. Yeah, screw it. We'll then go back to Fort Bush and we'll just keep on exploring this system um, for a little bit. I need to at least get countermeasures before I move anywhere. I'm going to guess it'll be pretty hard to um, progress. That being said, you can start anywhere um, in multiplayer, so that's probably what they designed it around. This is where you die. Enemy ships in range. We're painting them so you can ID them easily. Oh wow, he looks chunkier than usual, also it's still weak so it's fine, also also they're flying in space so maybe that was an issue with Freelancer not, uh, I mean they're all flying in space but like they're flying slowly in space, maybe that was detail of Freelancer versus um, Freelancer HD. This one's moving, it's just not using guns. Um. You know, I'm not going to complain, but I feel like a bit of a murderer at the moment. Okay, there you go. You do have guns. You do have guns. You know how to use them, I suppose. <laughs> okay, this is kind of sad. I'm sorry, rogues. Okay, I feel bad about this now. I'm guessing it gets harder, but I still feel bad about these four rogues. And again, like if they were flying normally and they were fighting normally, this might be pretty hard because uh, it's taking me a long time to shoot and kill any of these things. Wait, were they running away or they just not gotten to me yet? Well, here we go. Will this be more normal fight? Oh, they still don't seem to be very heavy on the guns. Okay. Fair enough. I don't know if there's a difficulty in what option I had. Okay. Well, 31 already. That's good. Yeah, that's okay, though. I'm okay if the NPCs are easy, because I just want to explore. Did I shoot something off it? I mean, that being said, this is the first system of Liberty. It should be easy. I just find it funny, that's all. It's like they uh, nerfed it on... I can hold her! Well, good job, I guess. Actually, let's just change over this mode. I'm going to try and see what's actually coming out of them in last minute. Because that could be their, their escape pod coming out early. Oh. Okay. Hey, I'm going to take the money? Don't get me wrong. I'm not complaining here. <laughs> oh, that was a great mission. Don't get me wrong. And I've got 13 Liberty Rogues. Damn, I need to... Okay, at this point I'm going to have a mutiny on my hands when my shipmates realize I can't do anything to stop them. More silencer stuff. A Belay turret, which is class 1. Wow, all that stuff is terrible, so no wonder they were pretty bad. Alright. Let's go to Fort Bush. Your request is granted. Proceed. Nine. Like, I hope the way they've approached this mod is this is what should, what we would have expected to happen after 
after Freelancer. So they've actually went off and been like, oh, they would have built this station here. They would have finished this here. Oh, this would have became more... What the hell? I'm not spending that much on a turret that I'm going to sell. Speaking of, damn, they sell for a lot more than I expect. Okay, because they're decent turrets. Gotcha. I mean, I'm not going to spend anything on anything, right? I think I've got a, this thing. I don't actually know what the difference is between these two. I mean, I don't have one currently, so I guess I need one, don't I? I don't know. Maybe it adds an additional bit onto it. I don't... I don't know. Now, do you guys take these criminals for a little bit? Yeah, you've got pretty decent prices price for them. But no, 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 no. S Sunbucks, coffee and donuts. Sunbucks is the official concession of the LPI. Consumption of any other product by LPI personnel while on duty or in uniform is strictly prohibited on the grounds for immediate termination for employment. Health warning. Consumptions of ridiculous amounts of coffee and donuts has been determined to cause the cause of belt tightening by Lithuanian Bureau of Excessive Health Regulations. Ridiculous is designed as during consumption, coffee and donuts have been determined to be a choking hazard to interstellar navigation, thereby banned. The cracking of jokes within 5 meter radius of a comms, consumption of coffee, donuts taking place is also banned. Dry sarcasm is permitted with limitations. For advisory uh, for details, refer to code 54... Okay, see. Ugh. Okay, can, can I just point out, A, it's a semi-decent trade route, um, but B, why would they do that? Why would that be a thing? That doesn't make any sense, because technically the LPI is a Liberty thing, and Liberty's all capitalistic, so I get the whole donuts joke, but still... Manhattan says we have to we have to snag a dozen rogues day here there. It's pretty tall order. I guess they're pretty short-handed in the assembly lines of Texas. Looks like I'll be hanging out in the Pittsburgh Debris field for the next few days. Okay, fair enough. Yeah, I kind of like the uh, these ones now. Yeah, might as well. Let's keep doing this. We'll keep doing a mission. Then we'll go into another space station. We'll keep doing a mission, go into another space station. Oh, oh, okay. That's a surprise. I should have read the mission more effectively, but anyway. Enemy ships will be at the mission waypoint. Refer to the nav map for specific instructions. I mean, the thing is, the Libby Rogues didn't have to hate me. I could have done this as a whole piratey thing, but like, oh, okay, what's this? Omicron Lost, New Berlin, New London, Ile de France. Oh, interesting. And what is in the help system? Ah, okay, role play, trading. Power core. Power core. When you buy equipment or ships manufactured by factions that don't match your ID, the power core will lose efficiency. This is an uphold realism and variety. Keep example Gallic Royal Navy from using equipment built exclusively for Bretonian enemies. Hell. That sounds annoying. Wish that was turned off in, in single player. One of the most important techniques used by skilled pilots is to shut off the engine and let the ship steer freely. It uses includes saving thruster energy, firing multiple cruise disruptors while maintaining cruise speed. Now moving your probes. Okay. 
<clears throat> Engine kill speed. Meh. Weird. I know, I'll, I'll take this as a multiplayer mod and try not to... I'll just enjoy myself and hopefully find, um... You say that, but last time it didn't go well for you. If nothing else, we're getting a lot of um, people in escape pods. So they can only fight, fight me, like, head on. So if I'm actively chasing one of them, it, I've just got infinite ability to kill them. Gotcha. It could just be this ship being sucky. Oh, there we go. Okay, this is a slight difference. Okay, so it was just that type of ship that sucked. Gotcha. Yeah, but like they're, they're, they're killing me like in seconds. This is the exact... Okay, now this I don't like any more than the other one. I'm sorry. What's the point of combat being incredibly easy or incredibly hard and nothing in between? Okay, this is silly. Okay, what the hell is the point of having combat be incredibly easy or incredibly hard and nothing in the middle? Um, this isn't reasonable. I don't think I'm doing anything wrong. I'm not running, I'm still fighting you piece of You're back within range of the waypoint. Try to keep it that way. Okay, what the hell? What the hell? Also, there was no wing of ships. Okay. That was stupid. Why did it just go from zero to a hundred in two seconds? 
I, I don't... I don't get it. Okay, that was weird. Alrighty then, hello everyone, sorry about the cut. I wanted to work out something and that something was basically... Ooh, what made the way down there? Okay, uh, and that something was basically, why was my difficulty so high? Turns out that's normal, very disturbingly normal. Um, so... What did I do about that? Well, apparently, you can try and lower it in the game options. I tried to do that. Uh, that didn't really work out well. Ooh, the resolution on this one is a lot smaller. No, it isn't. It's the same, but for some reason. Okay. Um, and then, so, I went back in and learned that, actually, freelance Discovery Freelancer deletes your single-player saves after you have played it. So, great. I love uh, people enforcing ways you can play. It's like, oh yeah, they don't want people to find out stuff about the, the, the galaxy in single player. Like, why not? Then the only thing, solutions online were start a private server, but then they also stop private servers as well. So, realistically, yeah, I'm not entirely sure what the goal is here, but, um, hmm, kind of a shame. If you want to play multiplayer, though, I guess it's fine. I guess for now, we just got to try and do, um, submissions. Now, they said basically that anything 17, 18, 19 is going to be stupidly hard. That is, that is what they said. So, we're going to try and stick to lower difficulty missions. And I want to just explore, damn it. <clears throat> is that so much to ask? Out there. Yeah, the UI is definitely different when you launch in the base freelancer versus the launcher. We've uploaded the mission waypoint into your nav map. Refer to it for more instructions. Well, here's hoping it, um, let's see. What a high maneuver bar. Cockpit? Yeah, okay. I mean, it's better this than having my save game deleted all the time. So, oh well. If worse comes worse, we'll just do a tour of Freelancer in this time. We'll just explore and see what we can find. Because if we don't fight anyone, we should be fine, right? Even the... Even the rogues won't hate us, um, if we're starting for a clean slate. Oh, wow. The installation should be in visual range. It is. You're in range. Remember, we've marked everything you need to take out. You're not taking the base. I mean, it seems like this is exactly what I'm gonna do, actually. Somebody needs some help? Actually, honestly, yes. Let's just be quite frank there. Yes, I will need some help. Now, I did try and lower difficulty. It was already set to the default of 0.5. I set down to 2.5, which should basically make me like a god. It should be one quarter the difficulty of before. It works. Sorry, we're half a difficulty before, not a quarter, because we, yeah, it's already a, qu a quarter of like full, a full freelance difficulty. Basically, is I've got to remember just not to ever open the launcher again, ever. Gotcha. What? How are we having to go so far out of the mission range to kill these guys? Weird choice. Yeah, I want to watch and see. What comes up? Because sometimes something comes up just the moments before they die. Is there two junk, isn't it? Hmm. Alright. Oi. Not 
sure how I feel about this, to be honest. But I've already reached day one, though, so that was about as far as I was before. And I've got a barrage, which are six, but is a lot more powerful. More energy usage, too. Interesting. I wonder if I should check if these class sixes are as powerful as the uh, rest. Oh, yeah, I still need my bloody um, armor, too. Mmm, blood armor. Delicious. Hey, let's go to Trenton instead. At least go somewhere new. Ugh. I just want to explore. I want to be a freelancer. <laughs> uh, I hate how... I hate how Discovery has went down the route of only being multiplayer. Oh, that's so sad. Ooh. Huh. Okay. We'll do what we did before, but... Yeah, they're all just better, right? Yeah, they are. Okay, so... Hmm, let's just sell one. Sell two. Equip the barrager, like so. And have a look what else is here. We've got a heavy star beam. Now, what speed do we these fire? They're at 8.8. .8. All of this stuff fires slower, but it's more powerful to boot. Advanced debilitator, class 6, pretty expensive. Interesting. Means we can't afford to upgrade both these guns straight away, so... Let's try and get them all to go with the 5 at the moment. Is there any other ships, that, any other guns that shoot exactly 5? Mm, there we go. Heavy star beam. 700. It's definitely slightly worse, but... I'd rather have them both flying at the same time. He's hoping I actually find one of those countermeasures. Oh, I would also like to upgrade, yes. Unfortunately, I don't think that's a possibility right now. Hmm. Interesting, they do not sell the level 1 stuff. Alliances are really annoying as well, because that's how they in enforce their, their roleplay. <sighs> Once again, if you don't want to do the roleplay, you just want to, what the? Um, thanks, Trenton? Sheesh. Also, <clears throat> these just random transport vessels that's docked here, that not actually docked here. One from Germany, one from, I assume, Liberty, and one from, I assume, Kasari. Okay, fair enough. This will definitely just be an explore the universe sort of thing. Wait, how long we take it to do it, I don't know. I kind of want to see if I can find something new though. So I'll keep trying to do some missions and such and see where we go. Go to California. Oh, the Mississippi has massive. What? Is it refueling? Must be refueling, right? I assume that means it's refueling. Alright. Before we go anyway, let's do one more mission here. Acknowledged. Your request Explore a little bit more of space.
because that's also important. I had like 18 Liberty Rogues before. Okay, I'm guessing I'm gonna have to go for this lower price one because um no no thank you to having the really powerful things again. Oh damn it! This I feel like you should have swapped what jobs you gained, mate. You, you gave mate. Uh This is the exact opposite thing that happened before. Refer to the nav map for specific instructions. My guns end up quickly, don't they? Galea even uses its own trade lanes. They wouldn't use Liberty's one because it was separated from us. Also knows that the speed isn't showing um, with the uh, obviously the same thing which um, deletes your saves is what also uh, sets up the UI properly. Ships in range. We mark them to make them easier to spot. Oh boy, here we go. Will this be laughably easy or yes, laughably easy? Good. Also outcasts here? Let's see what happens when... Hey, you know what? I'm gonna wait for them. Cause A, I can't even see how long they've, uh, they are away from me. And P, if I don't, the game yells at me. So I'm waiting right here for you guys. Yeah, close enough. In some ways, this is probably going to make me more money than the actual mission itself will. Yeah, it already has. Look. <clears throat> now they're even worth more for some reason. Wait a second. Do they even have any weapons on them? It really does go from stupidly... one extreme to the other, doesn't it? Oh god. That's a lot of them. <clears throat> Oh, 
That's only everything came off and before they even did anything, so... Maybe it's all in my head. So things definitely do come up earlier, but like... They just been they were already dying. Yeah, everything came off the ship moments before its destruction. Okay, sure. Let's go to Texas, because uh, at this point, we're going to need it, right? Like, look how many bloody outposts, um, outcasts we have. Our bolts wall definitely expanded. So I guess it's the thing, all the space stations have expanded, so that would imply that so is like other things further out there, so it does look nice though, doesn't it? And they're actually building stuff. Looks like a uh, couple of luxury liners or maybe battleships, I can't tell. They look like luxury liners to me, but they could be either. To be honest, I don't know what the state of technology is in our Liberty right now. I can buy crew. Huh. Deuterium. Engine components, which are obviously going to be very expensive, which we could do in the original, so that's uh. Ooh, they actually sell super trains. <laughs> oh boy. That would be not fun to play. I guess it'd be fun to roleplay, but uh, not fun to play. Alright, now I should be able to afford another gun now, right? So... Wait, what? I was going to say I don't have a hard point for that. Alright, let's get rid of the crappy star point thing. First of all, check. Do I have anything else? No. Okay. So do we have anything else around the five points? We have the other star beam. We've got stun pulse. Advanced debilitator. Damn. Ah, shield damage max. Actually, they're all shield damage max. The love blade though. That seems pretty good. I don't have enough credits. Well, shoot. I still don't have enough. I have made mistakes, yes. Oh well, guess I'm only running around with two guns until I do another mission. <coughs> Excuse me. Huh. Detroit Debris Field, isn't that... That's that one, so no thank you, bud. I'm not falling for that one twice. Freelancer Alpha 1 1. This is Baltimore Shipyard. Good luck out there. Stop. I was sick with only two weapons for now. At least taking a while longer for my power to be used up. Probably works out for the best, to be honest. Can you imagine just like dying with all those people in your cargo hold? Oh wow. 
Norfolk, what the hell happened to you? Chadwick Station, restricted. <laughs> Norfolk has became uh, a little bit bigger than I remember it. The big question is, is it actually restricted? And can I still dock on the Missouri? I'm gonna guess it is actually restricted. <clears throat> Let's go to Battleship, Missouri. Roger that. Your request to dock is granted. Please proceed to dock one. Here we go. Now that would be a nice ship to have. Or that. Oof. Wait. It's less powerful. It just looks cooler. Huh. Well, we don't have the money for it, so... More importantly, would you happen to buy these people a little bit higher since you're a military installation. No. That might be the max price for all I know. West Point Academy is training for the best of liberties officers. My family's put a man in the, into the point for the last six generations. I'm glad to be stationed here in the same system. Sometimes I'll pass a training patrol there's my heavy fighter and I'll know those kids. Let's get jealous. ALG handles all toxic wastes that the ship's reactors produce. Yeah, we already know that. We learned that last time. Being a bounty hunter is a tough job. Nobody likes you and love guys would be enjoy killing you. That's why I like it. Bounty hunters don't really operate like they used to. At the time when we were paid to bring criminals in, now we're paid to make criminals disappear. That's dark. Whoa! Okay, I've got to know how bad these missions are if I died to a a level 19 before. So let's see how quickly this kills me. Six G okay, let's make sure it's not too far away, just in case I do actually manage to survive. 6G? Wait, 6G? Yeah? Okay. Sure. This is not gonna go well, but if it does, that's an extra million dollars million dollars. One. This is Battleship Missouri. Good luck out there. Oh, this is not gonna go well, is it? Enemy ships will be at the mission waypoint. See the oh well, it's, the way, my, it's on my way out, so might as well at least have a look at it. I am. Be so nice. It says there's, there's advanced ships there already. It'd be so nice if just once they were like competent. And actually there, that would also be nice. Like if I could just be a nice little pretty face, but who knows, maybe reducing the uh, difficulty more would save me. But damn. I can only imagine what I'm going to be facing out here. There's the New York jump hole. Campaign. Good to see it's still around, I guess. What's gonna be here though? Like, what is going to be a level 28 mission? Okay, hey, well, rogues. We marked them to make them easier to spot. When I'm Fish. done with you, there won't be anything left to ID. You're just in time okay. to up. Well, you say that, but. I mean, clearly the ship I'm currently going for isn't very strong, but the rest of them certainly are. Really? 
Finally, guys. I don't know what I'm consistently sucking in there. I'm pretty sure all of my allies are now gone. So, so much for them for us mopping up. about I get the fuck out of here. Oh god. Okay, we learned a few things there. Firstly, ouch. Secondly, ouch. Okay, it looks like I was just getting the escape pods of the other people. Oh boy. Well, I mean, I got out of there with some money. Like... And Liberty Navy still doesn't hate me. they just like, yeah, this is what we thought. It's like, well, okay, fine. But, like, I tried. I really did try. Dog. I... Definitely need a stronger ship before I do that, though. Yes. Holy hell. Let's just sell these Liberty Navy guys straight away. I think we need to risk them. Your request to dock is granted. Proceed to dock one. Technically, I saved their lives, if nothing else. Oh wow, what an interesting new docking bay. I have never seen a docking bay like that before. Huh, fascinating. Well, that escalated quickly, didn't it? That's all military station. The West Point is selling the same amount, so... I mean, I guess it's saying basically send it to the police, like, or the, but if you sell it to the, um, rebels, it's probably worth a lot more, but, yeah, no. Oh, I hope that at least paid for my, uh, it should have at least paid for my repairs and stuff. You know, and this is probably a bad idea, but I'd like to have my full gun complement again. And now I can sell these Firestalker missiles. Damn, squatter mines, okay. In fact, these camera flares are actually worth a little bit too. Instead of getting lots of them, I might as well sell at least half of them. Um, okay, we could also upgrade our shields, which is probably a great idea, yes. Capital ship thruster. Yeah, somehow I don't think I'd need that, no. You actually sell the ah you do sell the universal ship armor yes let's get that okay well that escalated in a way I wasn't expecting much Ooh, repair ship cute and battleships and dreadnoughts sure that Sure. How did the difficulty of the mission spike so close? Oh, you know, these ones are still not fine, but it's 3E. 
two E, four D. They're all over the other side of the system. So I'm still gonna go to Texas, I reckon. I think that's my best bet to make anything of myself. Also, I still want to explore as the primary focus. I just like also don't want to completely just lose everything. I'm glad they didn't use a countermeasure to stop me escaping. That was nice at least. Like, um, Shocked actually had several of those from that fight. Like, seriously, it's, it's very odd. To go to Texas. Texas is is a battleground at the best of times. So yes, it's a battleground with prisons, and at the moment you've got a whole cargo bay of like 30 prisoners. Not to mention, if anything is going to give you the money you need to, uh, you know, stop sucking, it's going to be that. Thankfully, only the outcasts hate you so far, so it's not like you're in too much risk. Well, we, we've been to Texas before as well, so we should be able to see if there's any differences, like the new trade lanes that were found in, uh... Last one. Yeah, well. Clearly we wouldn't notice any stuff here. <laughs> yeah, it's just you call penitentiary system. Fair enough. Oh! That wasn't there before, I don't think. Cool. I just, right now, I just want to check out and see what's going on. Yeah, I will go over there, but like, I want to go to the prison first. Is there a prison around Prison Houston? No, oh, there is. It's moved. <laughs> Why'd you move the LPI Huntsville? Yeah, I guess it's easy to defend here versus where it was before, so... Yeah, it looks cool, going into star like that, something like that. Looks very imposing, good job. Also, I don't remember that being over there before, so I wonder if they've actually been like, yeah, they should orbit. Which is interesting. Alright, let's see, this is, a, this is specifically a prison, so... Really? That's just disappointing. Okay. Oof. Okay, so the second I go outside the main line systems, there's like, what, nothing I can do? This is regular fighting. Wouldn't mind a countermeasure dropper. What was the one I have? Sansa, right? It seems about right. Oh yes. I definitely need to buy more of those. <laughs> Loaded into cargo hold. All right. Well, as much as it's not a great idea, I want to see what's in this other area. So. This is prison station Huntsville. Good journey. Now, so we've got Virginia Jump Gate, Bering Jump Gate, and Hudson Budget Jump Gate. I'm pretty sure the one we've never seen before is Virginia, because I don't remember that being a system before. This has been built since Freelancer. Like this is this is a brand new trade lane for us anyway. The question is, did it exist in the previous line? 
life or is this a brand new system? Because I guess we'll have to read the planet descriptions or the systems. To see if they're like retconning freelance or being like, this has been 10 years later. This is definitely an interesting looking system. And the first one that, um, oh, what is that? Don't know if that's a, a nebula to go to or something else. Hmm, weird. Um, also very weird that there's, there's two planets that are like, very odd, okay. I oh, know they're not on top of each other, this look like it. Planet Reston. Hell, okay. We have a couple planets coming up. We got a minefield over there. This is like what looks like a free port, but it definitely isn't a free port. I'm gonna guess we're yeah, restricted. Though I am curious as to what happens if I go into the restricted space. I mean, I've got to say, this place does look very, uh, new? Both plant can... okay. Alpha Nu Supergate? Okay, I don't know if that's just a restriction via, um... I don't know if that's just a restriction via roleplay, or if it's an actual restriction. I'm guessing it's just via roleplay, because I should be able to make it through there. Also, really cool stations. Gotta keep, gotta, I give them very high props for their, their work on the stations. Also, also, heavy countermeasure dropper. Ooh, wow. Now, I'm going to guess, it may just be me, but, huh, wow, the price of H fuel is going up, in fact, Batman had to St. Aprons, that's a pretty good trade route right there. Nothing I can do there. Okay. Let's go and check something out. Like, <clears throat> it could be very. Okay. So, the super gate. This is definitely something we're not meant to go into. So, we need to see if it even lets us through the jump gate. Also, also. Damn. Okay, let's just go inside. Omicron new. I feel like even if we can make it through here, we're not going to last for very long. But same token, if they've made a brand new gate, I want to see it. Oops, sorry, that was me. Sorry. say anything about how it's restricted. Um, definitely a lot of weapons platforms around. Oh wow, look at the size of this gate. Oh, and what is that? That does not look like Liberty technology, no. Morgantown Border Station. Okay, I guess that shows you how far this will go. Omicron New. 
That is indeed a massive gate, yes. How do I even... Okay. Sure. I'm getting some Star Wars vibes from this, or Star Trek vibes. Star something vibes. Huh. And yet they're just selling light fry late fries and defenders. Okay, interesting. I mean the fact that the station that's selling stuff in general is still pretty interesting. Huh. They just blanketly sell prison uh, criminals. Interesting. Well, naturally, no one here likes me enough to give me a job, but still. Oh no, there are jobs. Holy balls! That's a big reward. Now, that's a big paycheck. Um, but that's not where I want to go. Well, we're not under attack yet, um, station. So, I guess there's no reason not to go into the quote unquote super gate. Holy... It's only the same animation as a regular gate. It's only the same sound effects as a regular gate. I'm sure that's a freelancer uh, problem though, not a... This game problem. Oh dear, please don't be death on the other side. Please don't be death on the other side. Okay. Where the hell are we? Oh, I can dock. land on that? Understood. Your request to dock is granted. Proceed to dock one. Station to heavy fighter patrol. Identify yourself. Received your transmission. DMV. What the? It's saying there's a... Hey, okay, well no one out here likes me either. Okay, it's universal shipping? Oh boy. Bioneural arrays. Okay. Okay. Fair enough. Now, it said there was a wreck somewhere here. Or is that the quote unquote wreck? Where's the... They said there's a wreck. Ah. Ah, those counters. Okay, that's weird. Alright, well... I mean, there's no reason not to go exploring, is there? I mean, actually, there's probably many reasons not to go exploring. Let's have a look where we actually even are. Um, whoa, the map looks bigger now. Wait, we're very close to the quote-unquote Omicron Lost System, which kind of concerns me. How far away is the planet? Who knows, but it won't tell me. There's something I've turned off in the... All over tips, auto high maneuver, tool tips, no. Nope. Okay, I literally have no idea how far away that is. Okay, plant midway. Large cyan, or even having the far periphery. Periphery orbital sand, so by Aegean pioneers proved futile due to dense gas counts found in the stratosphere. It has faint rings of azurite gases. And there's another star over there. Is there anything around at all? Oh, what is that? Well, SF is here, but what the hell is that? Let's not go... It's definitely something over there, though. Is 
Is it a nomad building? And whoa, what the hell is that? Oh, this is a nomad system, all right. They have a, not a Dyson Sphere, but something else. And what the hell's going over there? I'm going to regret this, aren't I? But at the same token, I'm kind of curious as to what the fudge is going on. Why is there that random anomaly there, like, pulling up everything? I was thinking around currently, so we should be able to see if we can get a little bit closer to this thing. Not sure if that's a great idea or not, granted. Is there any mining in this system, in this thing here? That is very odd. Definitely nomad though. Oh dear. There's no ships around though. Like, literally none. Plant Marshall. Deserted plant located from the Omicron new system. Okay. A proper survey has been performed. Communication signals indicate some form of human life might be present. Even the wreckage near the planet, it's assumed survivors may have crashed side the planet side, however, things have been oh. Atmospheric entry point. Also, also, there is a wreck over there, as it said. Battleship Tennessee. Well, I kind of want to see that, but like, I don't think it's gonna let me land anyway. Yeah. Very odd. Who's it belonging to, though? Doesn't say. Battleship Tennessee lost during a Texas instrument. Depressurized. Okay. Damn. Well, this is creepy as hell. Let's try and go over here, and then we'll go back to the, the gate, because clearly there's not much here for us, but, uh, what's that? There's lots of, um, what appears to be battleship hulls in orbit. Let's read about the battleship Tennessee while we're going away from it. Relative interact superstructure pockets of thin pressurization. Cursory analysis of the carbon scoring for out and for out. It's just the last profiles from due to munitions. Dried blood and small amounts of vacuum. Preserved human tissue can be found. Shows signs of multiple tests salvage over the course of many decades. Hey, the order's out here. This is order Gamma 2. We're out of order. Not surprised. <laughs> oh, it's just like, no, you know, who? Oh. Ah. Nope. Hmm, nope, nope, nope. Can't deal with that right now. Hello? What is that? An actual... Yeah, it's an actual battleship. That I can dock on. Roger that. Your request is granted. Please proceed to...
Okay, that's a surprise. Oh, look at that guy. Upholder. Nice. I wish I could afford that. I can't, though. I need to make a bunt more money before I can do that. Yes. Yeah, they're not even selling me anything here. We're on the verge of making what we thought would be a big find, but fuel storage for our recovery team protects us from acting on it for a week. Now he's now the site we're going to investigate is just gone. It doesn't add up. We'd be at least halfway done for our assignment here if not for the wily congressman back home. They keep bogging down our efforts and insane amounts of protocol and red tape. Uh, I wonder what we'll find out there. Can't sh sh shake the feeling we're onto something big. It's always intimidating, but any discoveries we do make will be the ones that go down in history, and I'm glad to be part of it. Ah, the missions here are surprisingly reasonable, but I don't want to be enemies of the Order. In fact, I'm surprised they would want to be enemies of the Order after what happened. They're literally just about... Okay. Uh, see you later, Liberty Cruiser. Unfortunately, I do not have the sensor range to pick up anything interesting. Like, uh, I mean, I'll tell you what, that was definitely interesting. But I think I'm ready to go now. Look how much explosive gas is in that pocket over there. That's definitely what that mark is. The train, apparently. Weird that it counts as a wreck. There must be other... Don't get me wrong, there must be other wormholes here. Like, I can't imagine just stub shoving up here and then nothing else. But I don't really want to go... here. Because that seems like a bad idea. say it's very interesting. Oh, wait, I can dock on that as well? Oh, I already did. That's right. No, I didn't. Yes, I did. That one I couldn't dock on. Can't even select it. I reckon mining would be quite profitable if I could just find a place with some rare resources. I'm noticing there's a lot less in the way of um, hostile NPCs, so I wonder if the idea is that they want um, the players to be the hostile NPCs when you're not on the mission. Or I could have just screwed myself by saying that, and there's actually a ton of um, pirates have just been missing. Also, also... Interesting. Oh, well, we're gonna go to that on our way out, aren't we? We'll set a thing to it. You say it's restricted, but same token, I'm totally going there, so... I guess the idea is it's restricted to certain, um, groups, and if you're in the VR, if you're in the RP, you'd be screwed over. Just like how I tried to get into Alaska, a few many versions ago now, didn't even have the trade lanes there. And, um, I had saved up for a rogue-based, uh, a rogue based thing so I you know escape in there and like I was green with them I should have just made it but nope now this is interesting that station is so high alright 
so we've got a couple of battle cruisers. We've got Planet Columbia. We've, I just got the minefield ahead of us. Frigid for a, ter a terrestrial world, but capable of supporting human life. It's relatively thin atmosphere and low gravity, which has given rise to numerous flying species, many of which are predatory pred carnivores. Nobody colonized this planet. Wait, what? Wait, 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 wait. Sorry, I was about to. Um, it's built a single massive pyramid-shaped complex on the surface in the Cheyenne Mountain complex. Partially to throw off um, foreign hooters so they would have perhaps mountain ranges. <sighs> okay. But it's not a Stargate reference, it's just funny. Can't dock on that, can't dock on that. I'm guessing the only place we're going to be able to dock is at the <laughs> Chesapeake Research Facility. Actually, they've got two there. They've got the Chef Spec Resource Facility and the shipyard right next to each other. Your request is granted. Can you dock on both of them? Weird. Very interesting. And yet they too only still have the very basic ships. Very interesting indeed. You think a research ship would have a lot of interesting stuff on it, but it's only got basic liberty shit stuff. Oh, it's got something. That's got the same. No, never mind. It doesn't have anything interesting. Huh. <clears throat> Mobile medical unit. Damn. Reconnaissance module. Research core survey team. I wonder if they're things for role play purposes and if they're things for like, hey, I've got a battleship and we're going on the survey mission, so we need a survey team. You know? Probably. We'd in no way be surprised. Since the station's construction, the government slowly began to enter some delicate projects based on Valhalla 1 to this base for safety reasons. It'd keep a certain level of secrecy around it. Of course, we know what we're doing here. Uh, if someone dares reveal anything about it, it will disappear pretty fast in a scary kind of way. The reality about the Nomad War is that we are the aggressors. Wait, what? Sirius was in intended to be their playground, yet we stole it from them. Nomads tried to reclaim it was supposed to be them, and we would have done the same in their place. Can we were blamed for it? Yes! LSF has been extremely invested in research on by the order on animatic technology. Luckily, we've been able to reproduce some of the prototypes based on the technologies we've been able to capture from them. Interesting. <laughs> John Doe, John Dove. Fair enough. So, here's the thing though. If you watch, uh, if you see the introduction of Freelancer, the full version, it is very. Oh, there is actually a trade loot in here. Trade lane in here. Of course there is. Just stopped. I can still get down there to that level, which is fine. Um, no, the interesting thing is that if you watch the introduction to Freelancer, it actually states that um, after we left, the nomads attacked. Like, just like that, the nomads just attacked us and basically destroy our sun. Whether that's not the case in Discovery, I don't know. But, like... Dark. Hmm. It's a shame Crossfire isn't working because Crossfire lets you go back to Soul System. I don't think this one does. Continue on actual journey idea, and that is, I want to see what's in this thing here. So, what is this? The Concord Belt is large but sparsely packed with asteroids. Much like those found in Hudson or Bering, it contains no resources of value but plays host to a contingent of Xenos. Ghost ships? Lots 
top local forward to stop getting fresh recruits to pursue drillers among the rocks. These exercises have become increasingly unpopular. Those have gone missing. Okay, well, at the moment, let's go see if we can take whatever this is from around Prant Leston. It's the cotton eye. There's gotta be something here, right? It's more of a wreck if there's nothing on it. Wait, what? I was gonna say. Oh, yep, there's definitely stuff here. Fantastic. Let's just go and. We actually got on our way so we got some tobacco which we want to sell to huh ironically the St. Ambrose platform but um let's just go back there then Stop. that wasn't all that dropped off was it it was just eight tobacco wasp missiles and here we go a couple of Raphael's and a cruise disruptor I mean I'm not going to say no to it that's pretty shit though that's also pretty shit they're all pretty bad let's be honest the cruise disruptor is probably the most useful thing but I, I highly doubt anyone's ever going to be running from me so To dock is granted. Please proceed to dock seven. I'm a trader from. This is Universal Yellow Ten. I'm on a trade mission from. Okay. Well, let's go sell the tiny amount of tobacco we found on that ship. I mean, it's worth something, I suppose. Also, go sell the Raphaels, which won't be worth very much, I'm guessing. No. Very interesting. Alright. I guess we'll go. Unless you've got a nice mission for me that I can actually take. No. No, you do not. We've got to go back to New York. On the plus side, at least we now know that going to the prison ship doesn't do anything. Like, I don't need to travel to Texas to sell the prisoners, I can sell them anywhere I bloody well please. That being said, do I really want to make massive enemies of the Liberty Rogues right now? I mean, just wondering if I should just explore. I don't know where I'm even going to be able to go. I kind of want to go to Bretonia. Also, Pennsylvania, whatever the fudge that is. It's on it's on my map even though I haven't even been there before. Huh. Weird choice.
I suppose I could just keep on exploring out here for a little bit. There's some of these other ones. If I go that way, I might reach um, Pennsylvania if I go back up. No, Pennsylvania's that away. There's nowhere new in, in New York I didn't see before. No, there's not. It's not any jump gates I can see. Let's go to Hudson. May not be the best idea, but still. really not getting very much in the way of um, that, like, pirate stacking us at the moment, which is interesting. I'm tempted to go to that prison, see if it's any better than the other one, but I think even if it was better than the other one, it probably would be worth traveling to. It has its buoys around the, well, okay, around the dark matter field, so fair enough. No, it says it says it's not dark matter field at all. It says it's uh okay. Let's go to Hudson, see what we can find. At the moment, it seems the only people who hate us are Liberty Rogues, so we should be able to explore pretty much anywhere we wish. Cold Bay. What the hell is Cold Bay? That's different. Also, the music is getting a little bit interesting too. Did we did we ever go to Cut Hudson though in the first place? I don't think we went to here last time, did we? got the Manitoba station and we've got Old Bay Depot. There are no ships around. Your request to dock is granted. Please proceed to dock two. It's planet form, so they must be going to terraform this planet, right? Yep, terraforming by Libya go and relocate manufacturing and economic and desirable independent worlds. Hmm, fair enough. I mean, I do appreciate the lack of pirates. Oh boy. It's all weapons platforms, that seems too risky. If it was just one big space station, I might give it a go. But no, I'm, I'm way too weak for anything here. Yes, this is a new place. Maybe it didn't have a base here before. Oh, Manitoba's got a um, liner docked out. I like their station work. I keep saying that, but I really do. Oh, wow. See, so that's cheaper than I would have expected. So they have interesting stuff out here, but the bloody uh, military base didn't. Huh. Freelance 
Sure, let's go to Hamburg. Wait, didn't he say that Hamburg was closed? Texas jump hole. I thought it said that Hamburg was closed. It seems like after the Nomad Crisis, um, we sort of screwed ourselves up. Like, the Nomads can still attack us, right? Okay, but like... Hamburg? Apparently, we can still get to Hamburg. Yeah, everything looks normal here. So going to German systems is like less interesting than what I was wanting to do. Wait, what? They actually made it so the Germans speak to each other in German? Oh, is that going to be the same everywhere? Will the Kasari speak in Japanese? Will the, will the Galean speak in French? I guess that's one way to get around the problem with voice actors. If I contact them, my start off is Altona. Okay, yeah, they've made everything speak in German here. Makes sense. Oh, please don't have all the UI elements in German too, or we're screwed. Does that mean I'm basically would be doomed to be in liberty like forever? Okay, good. Ooh, criminals are cheap here. Wait, they're not the same as the criminals in the other places? Wow, Manhattan really loves their synth pace. Damn. Like a lot, a lot. Okay. Now, would the Germans happen to have any jobs for me? Also, are all of them going speaking? Ah, they're not going speaking, gotcha. Okay, 24, that's reasonable, I guess. It's only not going to go very well for me, but still. 29, large space station weapon platforms. Okay, so it just says large station. So, if I save, first of all. And now I accept this large station one. If I can just blow up the station and ignore everything else, I'll be good. I should be able to get out of there pretty quickly. Which is whether I have the 
whenever I have the ability to take down the station, I suppose. Thank you. Um, once again, it does make sense. At least they're talking to me in an angry to understand. sand. Makes sense. I did. I am still Liberty. This is not going to go well, is it? But if I can get a million credits from doing this, it'll definitely be worth my time. So I gotta go in, avoid the gunshots, kill the large base, and then get the F out dodge. Is that how it goes? Look, I was able to kill one ship in that last stupidly expensive mission. Oh, there it is. You're almost there. The installation should be in visual range. Once the path has become the neon memo, you're in range. Remember, we've marked everything you need to take out. Ah! I'm out of here. Wait, what? Or not? Apparently we need to get everything. Nope. Or not. Well. That changes everything, doesn't it? Oh yeah, a million credits, that'll do nicely. Okay, so apparently bases are still easy to kill, even if ships aren't. So that's that's a good discovery. Sorry, unions. Uh, we're gonna not be friends at the moment. I think you don't dislike me that much. I guess I didn't kill you. I killed your space station. Which only is one thing. was successful actually very successful I can't afford a new ship yet I'm guessing but uh, if I did a few more I probably could not from here mine but still 1.2 million that's a pretty good uh, pickup right there hmm. realistically there's no reason for me not to try that again Not that there's very much uh, in the for me for buy here. Oh well. Look, if I can do that again, that would be a fantastic thing. Let's look for another just the insulation one. Well, that's, that also does match this, the thing, it's a little bit... Mm. 
Okay, I guess I'm going to go for this, um, this destruction mission. Sure. Yeah, no offense, but uh, why don't they show the um? Refer to it for more instructions. Eins, drei, vier, fünf, six, sieben, acht, neun. More, a little bit more, a little bit more, then stop. There's other stations over there. I guess we should go back there once we're done. Alright, once again. Can I sneak in, take down a few weapons platforms and sneak out? It does seem like they don't use um, counter uh, they don't use wasps as often, which is You're fantastic. You should be able to make out the installation soon if you can already. Hello, we got a hit of Rochen. You're in range. Oh. We've marked everything you need to take out. Die Basis bekommen sie nicht. I don't know what you're saying, I'm sorry. Bye. Oh, hey. Good timing. I mean, I consider that a total success. that planet? It's on the trade lane system? Doesn't look like it. Interesting. I definitely do miss the, uh, the range. Got here. Can I even click on that one? No. The hell's got a docking bay that doesn't go anywhere. Maybe it's a new station of construction. Uh, thank you. First of all, let's just repair and buy some other stuff. Like some more of these shields um, repair things. Ooh. Shield bots, very important. Loaded into all right. hold. Yeah, no, none of that stuff's going to be purchased from me. No, definitely not. Yeah, none of those are going to help for me, so it's time we leave again. Freelancer Alpha 1 1, here, Alpha Werft, good reise.
thing is, I probably am going the very wrong way at the moment. Right? Because, realistically, I'm going into German space, the one place I don't know anything about, so I won't even know what's new and what's not. I mean, I will when they start talking, but still. ships the space stations and run away like a mother trucker and you'll hand me. One's been destroyed. I think I remember that one. Freelancer, freelancer. Interesting. Sensor efficiency reduced. Why? Okay. Just because of what? Radiation? But there's no radiation here. There is, but not that I have to get into. Dormant station was a primary processing facility at HLG waste disposal. While the great Ryland was Cesaro's leader in waste disposal, uh, they had a little What happened? Uh, following the Imperial coup of 1827, the ALG relationship with the government soured. Brazilian attempted to capture the base from ALG. This attempt failed and the base was scuttled, dealing extreme damage to the base. Pollutants stored uh, in the tanks leaked out, so as a hazard for nearby traffic. Huh. Fascinating. So, this is part of some inter. Oh wow! Can't. Stop. All right. That's very interesting. Bestätigt. Anflugerlaubnis erteilt. Sie dürfen jetzt drei. All right. Let's go. First of all, do you have any ships? <laughs> I'm in the mall. Oh, not for that. I'm definitely not in the mall. Oh, I am for that though. Ooh. A heavy fighter. Those super heavy fighter looks stupid. Okay, no. Um, but that's, that heavy fighter looks fine. Okay, let's have a look here. So it's called the Surveyor. It's. Let's see. More guns. More base armor. Less, uh, less cargo. More power output, which seems very important. Many more batteries. I mean, I've got the money for it. Wait, what? Okay. Do I lose my license with this? I guess so. Interesting. You get a better shield though, and a bunch of guns, a bunch of slots for places I don't actually have. This is elite fighter gun. Is that different than a? Okay. Ooh, I hope I'm not gonna regret this. Purchase complete. I mean, I don't even think I had the money to replace my guns. Okay. Apparently, I replaced with that stuff. Alright, but like, apparently I still have money, so uh, fair enough. What do I actually want though? Are there any class nines? No. Alright, what about this? Helios Pulse Beam. Damn! I want to see what that looks like, but we don't have enough for it, so let's just wait. What? Why can I put all these ones on? Okay. 
Fighter Special Weapon. Purple Goddess Chain Gun. Moon Blast. The Moon Blast sounds fun. Then we're gonna get a couple of them. There we go. Yeah, so we've got four Moon Blasts now. Light Mining Array. Well, we don't have the ability to do that right now, but... Okay. We, we now have, I think, a new ship. And really low difficulty missions. Hmm. Ah, screw it. Let's do this then. I mean, it's a very heavy fighter, but base game freelancer barrier heavy fighters are still usable. It's a good looking ship for what it is. Alright, let's see here. So we've got. Oh wow. That is one interesting ship. Okay, fair. Don't need to stop firing for very long for it to get back up to max, so probably don't want to keep this for too long, but obviously since New Berlin is a starting system, hmm, it's going to be easier. Well, here they are. Yeah, weak um, installation, not surprising. You are getting close. You should be able to make out the installation soon if you can't already. You're in range. Remember, we've marked everything you need to take out. Unsere Basis bekommen Sie nie und nimmer. Ich dachte, ihr könnt jemand Hilfe brauchen. Excuse me. Excuse me. And excuse me. Now. Okay, yeah, this is a much more powerful ship. Gotcha. What? Does it not have a tractor beam? What? Does it not have a tractor beam? Why do you not have a tractor beam? Oh, I bet I know. The tractor beam comes from the license, doesn't it? I need to find a capable license of this ship. Well, they won't be rebuilding here anytime soon. This is a disappointment. Let's go to that battleship, it's pretty close, I think. Is there a reason that my ship does not have a tractor beam? I am assuming it's due to a lack of a license. Sie 
weird. So yes, I, look, I just read online that indeed the um, I need a license to do this properly. I bought. I had a freelancer one for. Oh, okay. So freelancer one is still fine. But why didn't you let me keep my old ID? I feel I feel gypped out of that one. All right, let's do this one instead. I still wonder what a hyperspace beacon is. Is this meant to be a civilian? Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Stop. I can't see what speed I'm going at, to be honest. I'm just after that last mission. I'm just like, no, I'm just gonna, just gonna wait. What the hell is fire special? The enemy. Maybe that's the chain gun we saw before. Yep, whatever you just said.
Now, I think what we've really got to do is go explore Leeds. But they said that the jet. What? Expecting mil um, weapons platforms. This was not a base destruction thing. Wow, they are definitely weaker. But I guess that's because you know. Ow. I should have said that, uh, but it's definitely because I'm in a more powerful ship now. Going through my my shields for surprise. I'm kind of curious to see what I'll get from these guys. You did it. The area is clear. Well done. Mission Commission signing off. Than, oh yeah! I mean, yeah, that looks pretty good to me. <laughs> He's hoping they fill up my ship. Looks like they do. I wonder if the only reason those other ships didn't fit on my ship was because I'm now in Germany, and um, only Rhineland weapon those ships will fit on my new thing. Dark. I don't know. I mean, they're all the right class, too. I might as well put the last two on. Now, another thing I'm interested in seeing... Oh, wow, yes, a bunch more of those, too. Is the Red Hussein Pirates. Pilots. They're not worth as much in Liberty, by the looks of it. So we better get rid of those before we go. That does mean I have to go back to Hamburg. I mean, I'm planning on going back. Excuse me. I'm planning on going back to um, Liberty Space anyway, so I can go to Leeds. But I kind of feel like I should probably make a little bit more money before I go anywhere. 
because if you think about it, um, yeah, Red Hussein's always hating me, yes. The Rhineland guys are loving me, though. Makes sense, makes sense. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, 40 fighters, 40 fi um, uh, fighters killed. Can't wait to kill some more, more people, though. I mean, what? I'm, I'm just going to go down to Hudson now. Although, Antona Station looks pretty cool, too. But no, no, no. down to Land Hamburg. Repair I even need. Repair complete. Okay, that wasn't me, that was my guns, but still I'll probably be able to sell them. Yeah, let's just equip these two. And oh, okay, all these ones. Um Now, what's better? Probably the one I've already got, yes. However, it's fine to have that one there, I think. I can sell the rest of them, that's fine. Aha, there's the special weapon they were talking about. Which I can't afford them. Nice if I could get one of them. Hmm. You know, I probably could if I did a mission or two. Need some more prisoner finds. Let's go and see. I might see if I can do that. I mean, it's a silly idea, but if I can do it, that's a million dollars. And I do have a good ship now, so worst case scenario, I'll just reload. Sorry, Unius. rare time where I don't need to try and like yoink my way out of a trade lane it's like directly from the base is there a reason it's not showing Very likely to be working alone. Like, well, last time all the good guys died anyway, so. Alright, here we go. There's a lot of them. There's a lot of those ships there. I'm actually not sure how this is going to go. Hopefully well. Oh god, I'm being shot at by Germans. Fine. Okay, let's fly around a little bit until I get my shields back and go for the next guy. Yeah, fly around a little bit more. Invasive maneuvers. Hi there, Chris. Kristen. Christian. I don't want to slow down because I, I really would rather, you know, kill you. Uh, 
um, but I'd also rather do so without losing my own stuff. Stay out until the shields are back. Come on, shields! Come on, shields! Finally, shield and sword also. Sword really high up too. Fantastic. Let's get behind them. Come on, a little bit more. Shields are low. Keep on avoiding them. Once upon a time, there used to be multiple servers of Freelancer Discovery. There was one that was just like regular play, and there was one that was role play. And it used to be a choose. Apparently, what they did was they changed to only one, only one server, and it's all role play all the time. I don't know if Crossfire is still that way or not. Let me guess. I'm not going to be done at the end of this, am I? Yep, there's some more. Oh, it should take them a while to get to me, so I should be able to kill this guy with no trouble whatsoever. Fine. Wow, there's a lot of people called August. Wow, my hull is uh, tanky, isn't it? I guess it does have the 2.5 modification, but you wouldn't think that would be very much. Come on, Matthias. Yours is low, but yours is lower. There we go. Let's get out of there. I'm getting on it. Okay, sword to sword. Didn't get too much hull damage, but good. Alright, turning around. Come on. Keep avoiding till my shield goes back up. And shields. Restored. Fantastic. Yeesh. I'd be interested to see where I make more money, where it's going to be the uh, prisoners. This probably won't be. Couldn't be, actually, because um, my hull is so small, it couldn't be my prisoners where I make less money. Guns, though. It'd still be interesting to see if the loot makes me more. Mine. Now I'm going to assume the um the whole thing with the uh, leads being taken was probably due to role play and not just like I reckon it would have been actual people taking leads and then when they took over they got to make choices as to what changed I doubt they would have um, had leads being taken over as something that they just decided on it seems so out of place uh. you did it the 
area is clear. Oh, thank you. Oh boy. Let's um yeah, let's just go straight over this one actually. Alright. Nineteen Union of Pilots. Pilots worth ten thousand piece, so hundred and ninety thousand extra. I really need a better shield, yes. Whoa. A lot of missiles, very powerful looking ones. Nothing else though, strangely enough. Okay, fair enough. This is being a good way of making money. I mean, more importantly, I should be able to buy one of those special guns now, right? Uh, or not. No, three million. Hmm, not yet. Why can that not go on? Not. Weird. Complete. <laughs> like seriously, could I actually build a base? I doubt it. I, I doubt it. I feel like that's something you need to petition the mod makers for if you manage to afford one of those. Not to mention everyone in your system to make sure they were okay with it. I could take the synth paste to Plant Manhattan, but I think I could probably make a lot more just by killing people along the way and doing quests, so... Field, Suited Hedge. Which one's one to north? Because Nordheim, Left Field. Yeah, you know what? No, I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna go and, and go north. I'm gonna go to Bering.
big question will be, when will they start speaking English again? Ah, right there. Okay. I have definitely been here before. I've definitely been to Bering before. It didn't look like this. Surely. I would have remembered if it looked like this. What happened? Is we went we had a whole left episode going here. Well, I'll definitely take those at least. Ah. Humbug gate re reconstruction site. Interesting. So, the Hamburg gate was destroyed and now is being rebuilt? Oh, 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 wait, hold up. Uh, hold up. What the hell is that? A lot more there than the one we destroyed. There's lots of them. Okay. That's the one we got to before, but what are the other ones? Oh wow. There's a lot of them around here. Okay. Oh wow. Okay, that's the one I shot. This one. Ones I haven't already shot. Yeah. Unknown. Oh, that's the remains of a niche. Okay. Been shot at. That one's not been shot at. So, what happened to Liberty and um, when did they make back up again? It seems that their war was pretty terrible. Is a Liberty gunboat just sitting there? I missed that before. I can't blow this one up either by the looks of it. Is it still alive? I mean, it looks fine. That is so weird. off. Did someone destroy the sun? Is that what happened here? station that is so weird I wish I knew where that was I don't want to go to it though how strange if I dock on that will it tell me more of the story Proceed to dock one. I want to know more about the story. Like, what happened here? <laughs> okay. Hmm. Does it 
reveal anything. That's interesting. It's also interesting that I got no cargo from blowing up those ships. That means only guns, right? Oh, wow. They're, well, they're shit, but they're also saying I don't have... Eh, ah, turrets. You can on that slot as well, huh? Interesting. I mean, they're all shit, but like, they're free, so... I'm not going to say no, but what I really want is something that increases my range of my scanner. <laughs> Takes up 170 cargo space. Okay, yeah, that's pretty massive. Strange. I hope someone in here will tell me something more. Nope. Look, I'm just gonna keep going back to Liberty because uh, I want to know more about this. Like, how did the war fill out this much space? But it's not just that. It's not just scrap either. There's a lot of scrap there, but like, there's also a lot of rocks. Which implied something happened beforehand too. So this is um, this is called a uh, bearing, isn't it? This is where we are, right? Yeah, bearing. Let's see what bearing looks like. Whoa! The music also. It's me that disrupted that one. music got a little bit more. No, bearing did look the same in the last one, apparently. I don't know why I thought it was something else. Oh, because I went between Rhineland and not Liberty, Rhineland and Betonia. So, yeah. Pacifica Base is one over there. We've got Hamburg Jump Hole. So, no, this is what it looks, used to look like. But still, interesting. Very strange. I see this is totally worth it, okay? Anyone who says otherwise is lying. It's their loot boxes, but they're free. I was gonna say, they don't have very much in the way of cargo, but I guess it makes sense, they're military. Yeah, you know, that's another 40k, I think that was still worth it. So that's a massive, massive asteroid over there. That feels like one they can make a base out of. Holy shit. Oh. Oh no. Freeport 2 got annihilated makes sense but damn that's harsh i'd surprise this would still be green in here you think it would have all okay what's built in space a freelancer satellite okay bristol depot where's the bristol depot that is the bristol depot yeesh Zoners must not have been happy by that. Insurgency battle cruiser. Is that does it actually have people on it? I don't know. I frankly don't want to find out. I don't want to bash it too much. Dark. 
that's right. I remember what happened now. I tried to go to the other place and uh, it didn't work. Because Ryan left. I gotta say, I wasn't expecting Freeport 1 to be destroyed. I'm guessing that wasn't in the base game. One also, it looks like it's got leaks coming off it. Maybe she must have an overheating core or something. Dark. On the plus side, at least I feel powerful enough that I can actually do stuff now. I should have taken the synth pace to Manhattan. That, um, I? What you doing there, bud? How can I get rid of you? There we go. Very odd that that East Dallas debris field is like completely marked by Hammers' market town. I mean, it might have been before for all I know, but you'd think they would have done that around the, the, the other field, not the debris field. I think what we're going to do is I'm going to go to somewhere, maybe over here, and then we'll end this episode, and then we'll go into Bretonia next episode. Go into Alaska, I'm not going to. Just I feel like I don't really need to. I want to explore. Like, before I went to the outer regions, so I thought the outer regions would be it's interesting, but now I'm sort of wondering, like, it seems like mostly the inter factionary information is a lot more enjoy, like, much more interesting to me. I want to know what's happening in Bretonia. I want to know if I can get to Bretonia if I need to use Jump Hole.
California. This is something else which is interesting when you think about. That's like 20 years ago, or 20 years in the future, right? California Miner was a terraforming project, right? Will it have made any progress? Like, this is one of the things which should be mildly different. Either the terraforming project would have failed, or you would expect it to be a few extra stages ahead. So will California Miner be green? I don't know. That'd be very cool if it was. Then again, you don't know how long it takes for terraforming to happen. Then again, then again, it's two then again, it's twice in a row. Um, you sort of would expect California, uh, you would sort of expect terraforming not take that long, because otherwise, why would they do it? If it took hundreds of years, they wouldn't do it. Still also want to go to Pen Pennsylvania if I can just find a way in. Oh well, maybe there'll be a way from um, California Minor. California in general, I should say. That thing in Cove, Cal Oh my god. Yes! Is that California Minor? It certainly looks like California Minor. Has it definitely. Has it actually improved? I think the terraforming may have worked. I'm pretty sure that's California Minor, and it looks a lot better than it used to. Makes perfect sense though. Now this makes me excited for the rest of this mod. Just for the sake of, I want to see it all. Also, also, trade lane ring. It's not even on the map. Okay, forget that. I want to know where this trade lane to nowhere goes. Like, the other ones are restricted. This one just goes off into the distance. But why? It, it's a random trade lane that just doesn't exist. Yeah, according to this, the trade lane is off. Where's it going? It's, it's, it's all got red lights on it. Like, that implies it's not working, right? Okay, Sierra Asteroid Field. I don't think I answered this in the base game. Hmm. Doesn't say anything. Is that a gate at the other end? Can't tell. Looks like it could be a gate at the other end. Is this how we go into Pennsylvania? But it, do you think it would be the opposite way? It definitely looks like. Or is it a prison? No, it's a gate. If we get going to California Minor, what the hell's going on here? Why is there a random gate in the middle of nowhere? And can we get into it? It's also got red lights on it, I think. Unknown. Huh. Let's just go to... jump gate huh so it's off network because it doesn't actually exist here we go but someone outdated the member of the Liberty sport group reassigned to lock down a portion of the Ontario system prior to it being abandoned by Liberty Oh no, oh no, small parts of the system it quickly became the most dangerous back wall across colonies. With the Ontario system now, now it's just living no longer the utility and trying to control, it was designed to watch over the remainder of Algira operations in California. Huh. Huh. Ontario system, huh? That is. Interesting, isn't it? Okay, I guess we're going back to Plant Mojave. The big question is how do we get into Ontario? Is this a way? Have a 
look, California Discovery Wiki. Let's see, we've got jump holes. Aha! There is indeed an Ontario jump hole. Like in this version of the thing, it actually says Ontario Jump Hole. There's a Pen Pennsylvania Jump Hole as well. It apparently connects to a lot of places I've never heard of before. All right. Let's see if it's even here. There was apparently a jump hole here at one point. Right in D3, which is right where I am. Uh, is that it there? Nope. Maybe it's literally just been removed from the network entirely. That shouldn't be possible though, right? You can't just remove a jump hole. Can you? So there remains of some sort of ship, a space station over here. Nope, there it goes, Ontario jump hole. Will it work though? Duh. I don't know. And what's going to be found in here? Like one would imagine there'll still be trade lanes, but they'll be all just, just un unoperational. Is this going to be a completely pirate system? Why am I even going through here? Oh god, I'm going in! But you know what? This seems a good place to end the episode. No, I'm kidding. Let's at least see it, then I'll end it. And then we'll make our explanation next time. Okay. There are space stations. Okay. Interesting. There are planets. There are space stations. I guess we'll go to the space station and save our game. Assuming we could land there. One would imagine... Okay, so rogues just live here, that makes sense. The rogues don't like me, do they? Apparently rogues don't care about me, fair enough. Uh-huh. They used to be trade lane, but looks like they completely disabled it. The Xenos are out here too, this is definitely a uh, interesting system. No, it's trade lane still there. But whether it's actually operational, no it is not. It's been turned off. Okay. You'd think the rogues would have taken this space station, right? We'd think they could just turn off an entire system. One of the recent oh okay never mind something's happening here it just says sector blah can I even land here whoa whoa whoa, whoa. hold up rebel rebel vindicator vindicator what 
Um, Ontario is one of the recent explorations of Liberty Space, easily attached reach from the California system. Despite Liberty Police having a Fortin system, piracy and smuggling by Xeno slave having really roads continues. What what made them leave? So spooky. It's like literally they just left. Something over there. Were they just fed up with like pirates and they just left? Work out what actually is where the um, wreck large transport. Oh, they're back around there. Nope, it's back here. Feels eerie. All right, here we go. Oh, nothing here. Very strange. Okay, back to where we're going. Let's see another jump gate was there. way of like there's nothing on here about what happened here it's just completely everything's gone it's like they decide this wasn't part of the mod anymore I mean I guess it makes sense that the uh, pirates would uh, go away after everything was gone but like you know, not does it though they could they could use the space uh, Let's even wreck. Moving on pits. Reduce. No more enemy targets. Raising pirate. Be empty. Do anything believe useful and abandoned. Huh. And uh, there was definitely a gate there. Ready to open fire. Engage all enemy targets. All right. This is Junker Sigma Five. I'm from. Ah, toxic waste in the clouds. Lovely. Makes sense. I mean, it's definitely still Xenos and, and like pirates here, but like. There's two more planets over there. What if we fly in the general vicinity of that other area? And try and get to those other planets. There's gotta be a there's gotta be something here, right? Something has to survive.
ice field and there is a jump hole over there. An unstable jump hole. Bounty hunters coming out of it? Uh, do I even want to go through this unstable jump hole? Is that even a good idea? Um. Oh god, okay. I can go through it. So we've got save games, I can always reload earlier, I think. Actually, do I have save games? No, I don't probably. Oh god, I hope this isn't just a one-way portal. I don't even know where this is gonna go. Oh dear. Where the fudge are we? Kepler. Well, it looks like there is a trade lane over there, so... What the hell? We're halfway to Kasari. Hey, never mind. I guess we're not going to go see um, Liberty. Or even California Minor. Hey, Brittany, or even California Minor. Okay, looks like we're going to the Ames Research Station. Colorado. Chicago. Well, that answers where we are. I don't remember it being this dark here. Dark. Okay. To dock is granted. Please proceed to dock four. Sure. Where the hell are we? I know where we are, but like, this is a whole new place. So Kepler. Kepler have this much? No, Kepler was not like this in the last game. The clouds is dark burn system, so never mind. I guess the clouds grew. I mean, it is all dark burn. Say it is, though. Ah, oh, no, see, the, the clouds used to be a lot smaller. I see, the clouds used to be very small, and now it looks like they've taken over the whole area. Okay, that's dark. Jesus, okay, um. Repair complete. Well, I guess we're going to be approaching, um, oh wow. They have a lot of stuff here, don't they? Zoner ID, huh. That's cool. And that's cooler. Well, it's a very solid upgrade to what I have. A little bit slower, a little bit faster in other ways. I think that's a great upgrade. Complete. Although I want to definitely trade out my guns because uh, unfortunately I'm guessing they won't work very well anymore. I'm probably going to not have as many guns as I should have. Alright, let's just replace them with... A couple of Furies. A bunch of those. 
apparently I can get a light turret and a fight a special weapon, so... Well, I like that one. You can see my other things seem to give mostly, um... Hull damage, maybe I should get the advanced debilitated turret. No, I can't, can't afford it. Okay. Yeah, let's make sure we get out. Oh, oh shit. Oh, good, okay. I was gonna say, I couldn't, I was afraid I couldn't buy it for a second there. Um. Or I came with free um, ship armor, that's nice. Holy hell. Honestly though, I think that's where we gotta stop. Things have definitely changed in this system, haven't they? I guess we're gonna explore Kasari next. That's a surprise. But um yeah. Ooh, counterfeit software. Nice. Thank you for joining me today. This has been Freelancer Discovery, where we are discovering a a lot. Who knew, right? Well, thank you for joining us today. I'll see you next time on Freelancer Discovery. Wonder how long this season will last or if I'll accidentally delete my save game again. See ya.